Today we're going to go over a topic that's a real pain in the neck. It's a pinched nerve. Pinched nerves can occur in different parts of the body. When it occurs in the wrist, it's called carpal tunnel. When it occurs in your lower back, referred to as sciatica. Today we're going to go over what happens when you have a pinched nerve in the neck and who you should see to get it corrected. Now with a pinched nerve, it could create pain in the neck, one side or both sides. The pain could travel into the shoulders. You can get weakness or even numbness into the hands. Now there are three common causes for pinched nerves. Number one could be from arthritis, maybe from an old injury or a car accident. Number two could be from a herniated disc. And number three, the most common cause of pinched nerve neck pain is a subluxation. What a subluxation is, there are seven different bones in your neck and they're all designed to move. When one of them doesn't move, that's called a subluxation. Now, our approach here at the Living Well for Life Center is to correct the cause of a pinched nerve. It's not to use medication, not to use any shots or any type of uh, muscle relaxers. Neck problems, pinched nerves are structural problems and they require a structural solution. We've had been treating patients with these pinched nerves for over 20 years. Extremely good success rate. If you have neck pain or know someone who does, please share this with them. This might be very helpful.